Have you ever thought about what would happen if the sun, yeah, that giant fiery ball in the sky that's always shining down on us, suddenly went boom? I know, it sounds like something out of a sci-fi movie, but let's break it down and see what would really happen. First off, let's talk about the sun. Did you know the sun is actually a star? But not just any star, it's a massive one. It's so huge that you could fit about 1.3 million Earths inside of it. Imagine that. The sun is like this gigantic nuclear reactor, burning up hydrogen at its core and turning it into helium. This process, called nuclear fusion, is what gives us all that amazing heat and light. Without it, we wouldn't be here at all. Now now let's say something goes wrong and the sun decides to explode. Kaboom! This wouldn't just be some little spark in the sky, it would be the biggest explosion you could ever imagine. But here's the thing, if the sun did explode, we wouldn't know right away. That's because the sun is about 93 million miles away from us, and it takes light about 8 minutes to travel from the sun to earth. So we'd have exactly 8 minutes of normal life before everything changed. Once that 8 minutes is up, things would start getting really weird. First we'd see this insane insanely bright flash of light, like the biggest, brightest fireworks ever. But it wouldn't last long. After that, the sky would go completely black. No more sunshine, no more daylight, just pitch black darkness. It would be like someone flipped off the light switch for the entire planet. But wait, it gets crazier. Without the sun's warmth, Earth would start cooling down really fast. Imagine how cold it gets on a winter night, and then multiply that by like, a million. Within a few days, the temperature would drop to minus 100 degrees Fahrenheit. That's so cold even Antarctica would feel like a beach vacation. And it wouldn't stop there. The oceans would start freezing over too. You could probably walk from one continent to another over a frozen ocean. If you could survive the cold, that is. But that's not all. Without the sun, plants can't do their job. You see, plants need sunlight to do something called photosynthesis. That's when they take sunlight and turn it into food. No sunlight means no photosynthesis, which means no plants. And if there are no plants, there's no food for animals or us. Plus, plants are the ones that make oxygen, which is what we breathe. So without the sun, we'd run out of oxygen pretty fast. Imagine trying to breathe and there's no air. And if that's not scary enough, let's talk about gravity. The sun's gravity is what keeps all the planets in our solar system in check, like a big cosmic dance. Without the sun pulling on us, Earth and all the other planets would just drift off into space. We'd be like a bunch of marbles rolling around with no direction. We could end up anywhere, or crash into something else out there in the universe. It's like playing pinball with planets, and trust me, that's not a game we'd want to play. But here's the good news. The sun isn't going to explode anytime soon. In fact, scientists say it's got about 5 billion years left before it even starts to run out of fuel. When that happens, the sun won't explode like a bomb. Instead, it'll swell up into a red giant gobbling up the inner planets, sorry, Mercury and Venus, and then shrink down into a white dwarf, a tiny dense star that will quietly fade away. So we're safe for now. So next time you're out enjoying a sunny day, take a moment to think about how awesome the sun is. It's not just keeping us warm and lighting up our days, it's the reason we're all here. Thanks for hanging out with me and diving into this wild what if scenario. If you like this video, make sure to hit that like button, subscribe for more cool space stuff, and share this with your friends who love imagining the craziest what if moments. Bye.